tonight we have a lot to talk about. It has been 23 days now since anyone has seen or heard of Easy McPeasy, our new town superhero. And tonight we have Grace Slayman and Mayor Adams on the debate stage. And Little Miss Hollywood will be hosting tonight's debate. She's going to be giving the tough questions that this town is asking. Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood, can I have your autograph? Oh, hello! <laughs> oh, they love me! Can't get enough! Oh, how old are you? Ten. Oh, ten years old! Oh, my goodness. Oh, you have such amazing taste at such a young age. Yes, darling, yes. <laughs> what do you love about me? Everything. Everything! Oh, my God! Oh, there you are. There you are. Please tell your friends and family. Mrs. is the best. Thank you. Oh, I just love my family. Welcome to the debate tonight between Mayor Adams and Grease Lightning. There's going to be a lot of mayorism tonight. I can't wait to see what they have to say. There's going to be questions and answers and answers and questions. <laughs> Let's get over there right away. Hello, everybody. It's me, Mrs. Hollywood. And yes, what we are doing tonight is we are here at the debate between Mayor Adams and Grease Lightning. So I'm going to be asking questions that the city is dying to hear what's going on and what they plan on doing to help us out. So here it is. Question one, Mayor Adams. What are you gonna do to better this city? Hey everybody, glad to be here. You know, last year on the big stage, I was all about five times. Five times this and five times that. You know, this year, we're all about 10 times. 10 times the construction, 10 times the tax relief, 10 times the look. This year, we're going 10 times. So if anyone wants to know, what are we doing? 10 times! 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 Hello, everybody. Yeah. All right, let me get this right here. Y'all need to know I'm the man. Together we can build up a real good plan. See, I'll be your mayor, and you'll be safe and sound. Yeah, with you a kind, working to turn this town around. I believe we can do it. You'll see the best combination is your vote for me. Sky's the limit, no room to see. We're voting for the future, cause the future's not free, so it's all so fast behind it. We hit it down the road. We'll bring the city where it's never been before. Cause I'll be your mayor, and this is what it's all about. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we're two of a kind. We're gonna turn this town around. is the reason we should keep you in our mayorism job and position. Ten times. All right. I know crime has been a thing of the question lately. That in prices have been a thing of the question. And also, he's McPee has been gone for 23 days has been a thing of the question. But you know what? I know where he's at, and he's got a plan going on. So that's why we're sticking to ten times again. Ten times, everybody. <laughs> That guy. That guy knows what I'm talking about. And Grace Lightning, how much mayorism do you have in you to run this city? All right. You all gotta vote for me now. To stop this city from catching on fire. Say the one thing. I believe I could win this fight. So we want to stop, stop crime, crime. You gotta, gotta vote, vote for me tonight. And there you have it, folks. That was the mayorism debate for the city. And everybody needs to get out and vote. Who are you going to vote for? Mayor Adams or Grease Lightning? It all depends on your vote and my vote as well. It's your choice. Your count. <laughs>
And there you have it. That is the debate between Mayor Adams and Grease Lightning. Everyone get out and vote tonight. The future relies on you. Have a good night. And cut. So where are you going tonight? <sighs> yeah, you see, I need to go out and do some undercover work by myself. I really think I have a lead on where Easman Peasy has been hiding the last 23 days. I'll be night. All right, I got to go to one of the residents of East McPeasy. There has been a very long line of East McPeasy's. The family goes back for generations, and I'm hoping to speak with one of them. I'm hoping I can have a word with Easy McPeasy the Great, also known as the Doc. Easy McPeasy the Great was once this town's biggest supervillain, but luckily he has been retired for many years. And I'm hoping he'll help me figure out where the wizard is located. Hello, Earth News. Hey, thanks for letting me in. I have a feeling I may know someone that might know where East New Peace is located. Do you have any idea on where the wizard may be located? What did you say? Yeah, I'm trying to find exactly the location of the wizard. I only know one person that knows where the wizard is. Sheba. Yes, boss. How you doing? Hey, how's it going? <laughs> you know where the wizard is? Yeah, here's his card. Oh yeah, thank you. Really appreciate it. Y'all have a good day. Alright, I've never met the wizard before, but I heard he is very wise and very mysterious. I'm hoping he can help me understand where Easy McPeasy has been located. You know what? That makes sense right there. Hold on. I really, really agree with what you're saying. Ah, uh, that's fantastic. But know you're here. You're here to find where Easy McPeasy has been hiding this whole time. Yes, I'd really like to know exactly the location and figure out where Easy McPeasy has been hiding for the last 23 days. Okay, good. Because the only way you're going to find Easy McPeasy is you first got to know yourself. This story goes back before you were on Earth News. You were on a different TV show called Spaghetti Wars. And you gave it your all to make the best spaghetti that day. Yes, you did. Not bad. Let's see what we got here. All right, yes. I see a lot of good things in here. And you know what I recognize plenty of is a little bit of yes. But you know, there is some things I do question. We have to bring it to the scoreboard. Your spaghetti accessories are okay. I give an okay 8.5. Yes, your spaghetti is where it's supposed to be. I give a yes 9.8. You know the thing I don't see here? I do not see no hell yes. There is no hell yes here. I see no hell yes. I give a zero hell yes. Now we will judge your spaghetti on taste and performance. Good luck to you. You see, it's all unorganized. I don't even know where to go in at. All right, there was one thing I did like about this whole thing. It was yummy. It was yummy. So that's why at the right time, you will find out. Thank you. Have a good day now. Now good luck. You should be able to find Easy Make Peasy. <sighs> you know, being a wizard, it never gets old. It never does. <laughs> Especially these days. Really. Oh, 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 oh.